All right, what's up, guys? I'm Bryce. I'm Rob. And I'm Zuff. And we are Real Time. Today, we're back with another special movie reaction. This time, we got Glass Onion, a Knives Out mystery. Oh. Now, a lot of you guys probably don't know, but we actually did do Knives Out when it came out. like Very a, early on on the channel. Yeah, like a year ago. It was one of the first movies we ever did. And it's not on the channel. It was never on the channel. It was. It gave us a lot of copyright issues. Literally rendered Couldn't it, get it up. got it up like probably 13 different versions of that video could not get it up so we had that up i think on our patreon for like seven months just as like a free like video we made a yeah. post about it and i'm sure a lot of people saw it but now it is up if you guys do want to check that out it's up on our patreon as like we have like a deleted videos or reactions section on there so that's up on there if you guys really want to check that out but now we are doing glass onion this is pretty new and we've been looking forward to watching it i think ever since it dropped obviously we uh, yeah I, i've been looking forward to it ever since we watched the first one because i feel i think we knew that this was coming was this already announced mm, i can't remember I, I was either pumped while when we watched a knives out or as soon as this was announced because i i loved knives out yeah it was, awesome. it was really good that was when i was introduced to my celebrity crush anna the armist yeah, she's was, beautiful yeah. she's beautiful that was the first time i've seen her in a film and wow did she just grab my heart mm. and same thing with this uh episode or this yeah movie. i was gonna say you you have it, another celebrity crush we've got uh movie. sarah cameron in this madeline klein, madeline madeline klein and she just takes my heart and mm, just squeezes it can't feel good right <laughs> <laughs> she has a freaking she just absolutely has she has a choke hold on Zoe. yeah she has a choke hold on my heart but there's a lot of really good actors in this. There was a lot of really good ones in the first one as well, but I'm, I'm excited for this one because it's like a fresh cast and there's a bunch of new people and they're all super solid. Like Edward Norton, Dave Bautista, obviously we said Madeline Klein, uh, Daniel Craig's back, Benoit Blanc, have to have him. Wouldn't be Knives Out without Benoit Blanc. Um, and there's a bunch more that I cannot think of right now, but. I'm excited for this one because the first one was awesome but it was like a family, like in like their estate mm -hmm. type thing. But this is just like, I'm pretty sure just like friends on vacation. Like I saw, I did see in the trailer, like kind of how they get invited. And I'm sure we'll see that in here. So I don't want to talk about it too much, but yeah, it's, I think it's just going to be more like a vacation vibe because I don't think they know exactly what's going to happen here. I've seen Daniel Craig in a lot of silly outfits, like vacation outfits. So I'm, I'm excited to see those in action. All right, guys, that's pretty much it, though, before we do get into this movie. If you guys do enjoy our movie reactions, make sure to drop a like, comment, and subscribe. Over 81% of you guys are currently not subscribed, so if you're brand new here to the channel, make sure to hit that button. It helps us out a ton. We really, really appreciate that. Also, check out all the links in our description. We got the Patreon, the Discord, and all of our social medias linked down there, so check all three of those out. Then at the very bottom of the description is going to be the address to our P.O. Box. If you guys want to send us any anything to be open up in our series mail time, like everything you see behind us right now, make sure to do that. But yeah, let's get into it. Glass Onion, a Knives Out Mystery. Let's go. Baby, come on, look alive. Hold the keys. On in 10, he's leading you in now. Oh, she's like a political. Oh, she's about to do an interview. This is it. It's from Miles. Oh. And Who's Miles? Oh, she's the governor of Connecticut. The man faxes me in the middle of the night. He loves his faxes. He sends me his ideas that I'm supposed to. You know what? You tell me. Remember child equals NFT? <laughs> what? Why can't she have her phone? Because she's mean. No. <laughs> because she's afraid that I will tweet. Can't tweet. An ethnic slur. <laughs> Jeez, dude. <laughs> Again. 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 For the second time. No. Uh, maybe more. I didn't even know that that word referred to Jewish people. I oh, was dude. It was a weird term for cheap. Jewy. <sighs> wow. <laughs> Didn't know it was meant for Jewish people, huh? It's just like a block of wood. Yeah. Well, there's got to be a way to open it. It's solid. Right. There's no latches or even visible seams. The wood grain pattern's weird, though. It's like it's familiar. Hmm. Oh. How the heck do you open this thing? Yeah, they can't figure out how to open the box. Hmm. <clears throat> so this is Dave Batista so here. Recently, so obviously, I would like to speak to this. And the answer is no, Jimmy Kimmel. I do not hate boobs. <laughs> what? Give us many useful things. Boobs give us milk cheese breast nourish what kind of until the age response video is this love squeezing a boobie and some cheese out i mean there's nothing wrong with that right babe whoa oh, love my boobs they're so much fun oops sorry feminist sorry. <laughs> oh my God. one 
but we're talking about the wow hello madeline klein oh will you shut it he lives with his mom a million times i told you when me and whisker alive you gotta let us do damn put him in his place <laughs> Whoa, what? Oh. That's wild. How did he do that? Yo. Yeah, right. Look, you could have found that. Do you group them by color, maybe? or size? This is complex. Yeah, I wouldn't be able to go because I'd never figure this out. <laughs> Freaking Miles, man. Genius. That first one's a Fibonacci sequence. Ma! His mom knows everything. Yeah. Like he needs to bring his mom to the mystery. She'd solve it instantly. I can't wait to see Benoit Blanc. It closed. And reopened. Wow. An onion. It's an onion. You are cordially invited for a long weekend on my private island. My, Miles is definitely dead, right? That like, us that's the mystery. I don't know. Because you will also be competing to solve the mystery of my death, of my murder. Yep. Murder. Ma, where's my spear gun? I got a pack. Babe, get pack. What's that? Never did I ever think I'd see Dave Bautista and Madeline Klein coupled up in a yeah. Movie. No, you. Yeah. Oh, she got it too. She's just breaking it. This is like the smart thing to do, I think. Same result, right? Look, like she's not as close with the other people. Yeah, why didn't they call her? I mean, if there's more people too that didn't get called. Oh my. Are you kidding me? Big Red. We're playing Among Us Wait, right now? Hold on. He's practicing for his job. You're the imposter. We all know it. Case closed. We're He's playing down. Among Us in the bathtub, bro. That's actually amazing. Just over. Sorry, Blanc. You're thrown out of the airlock. It's a no brain. That's Kareem Abdul Jabbar. Yeah. Yeah. What? I you... Is that Natasha Beddingfield? No. Oh. I appreciate what you're all trying to do for me here. Trying to get him some action. It's probably been a while. Lockdown hasn't been easy for any of us. I lose it. Between cases, anyway. I think I'm happy going insane. Ah, uh, he he just craves the the rush from his mysteries. Yeah, I need a great case. You got a package. There's someone here for you with a box. Huh. Here we go, baby. Last onion time. I'm pumped. Hey, of course, this lady that can't tweet's not wearing the one not wearing a mask. No, Bernie, we clearly just arrived. She's wearing a fucking oh. mesh mask. Oh, even worse. It's got to be Dave Batista. Gunshots. She's just shooting. My wife, dude. There my she is. My wife. Nope, mine. It's mine. She's just shooting her gun. Ladies and gentlemen, Ethan Hawke. Oh my God! I didn't know he was in this. I didn't either. First, I'm going to need you to remove your mask and extend your tongue. This will only be momentarily uncomfortable. Mr. Cody, what, was what that? is happening? You won't be needing that anymore. I won't. You're good. It's the vaccine right there, bro. What the <laughs> hell? That is so sketchy, bro. This dude's like a. Tech billionaire, maybe he knows something. Yep. What's up with her, bro? She must have beef with them or something. Yeah, Isn't there like, like more people too? She must have been like kicked out of their group or something. Andy started Alpha with Miles ten years ago, just the two of them. Hmm. That's Cassandra Brand. One legal move would cut her out completely. Booted her without a dime. Social network. Jeez, Dang. man. The question isn't why do you invite him? Why did she show up? Why did she show up? If she has a reason to murder him. Is he going to be murdered when they get here? Because then it's like, none of these guys did it. Right? I don't know. Wow. Whoa. This is quite the entrance, Is that Dr. Bro. Banksy? <laughs> Piece of shit. Oh, is that the name of the island in Greece? Piece of shit. Piece of shit. Piece of shit. Oh, oh. 
whiskey. Wow. I just I love that. Ne that was weird. This whole bring, thing. Bring it in. <laughs> How you doing? It's what so is this? Good. Hug. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The island. I've seen this Big hug island, before. Huh? Sexy, right? What the hell? So, uh... <laughs> it's weird. Did he not invite her? Andy. You're here. No, he just didn't think she'd yeah. show up. Alright, we met everyone. Who kills him? Mm. Early predictions. Whiskey. Maybe Andy. I got Dave Bautista's character. We got a great weekend. Just our gang. Just us. Hey, hey. Hey, bro. Not here. And some drunk dude. <laughs> Who the hell was that? That's Daryl. He's, he's just staying here. He's going through some things, but he's not part of the experience at all. Wow. It's like that's a awesome. glass onion. That's glass what onion. was, uh, that's what the thing that the oh, yeah. note was in. Amazing. Dumb. What in the world? What, what? Dong. Your biorhythm monitor is the key to your room. It'll lead oh you God. to the room using haptics. Get get settled in. What? Change. That is crazy technology, bro. What? What are you doing here? What? Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. What are you doing here? You invited me. You invited me. No, I didn't. What? Oh. You sent me a box. You received a box? Yes. This is just like the other ones, but I didn't send it to you. Huh? I can't tell if he's serious. Yeah. I, I, once the boxes are open and the puzzle's complete, is there any way to close them again? To, to reset them? Someone reset the box. Someone reset the box. Oh, they sent it to oh, you oh. as a gag. A gag? I'd be kind of disappointed if I was Benoit Blanc. Yeah. Mr. Braun, I've learned through bitter experience that a, an anonymous invitation is not to be trifled with. Okay, look, come on. I'd love to. Okay, have so you whoever sent it home. is planning on killing him. It couldn't have been Andy because she broke hers, right? Yeah, that that completely rules Andy out of sending it. Look at this pool. I think I'll go for a swim. Who's in there? Oh, oh my goodness, it's Madeline Klein. Okay, really he's an that. angel. She said, maybe I'll lay out for yeah. a bit. You can, that's <laughs> cool. yeah. Can't follow up Madeline no. Klein. There he of course is. he wears one of those bathing suits. What is... Oh, is a gun. God. Really, Duke? <laughs> Damn, bro. <laughs> Why, bro? He's sweet. When he goes to his room, just follow him and then just do it. I will take care of him. Don't worry. What? She just pulled out a knight and said, knife and said, just do it. What? Oh, my God. Yeah, they're, they've been close. Mm. Andy's just chilling. Look at this blast from my past. Look, everybody. Look. Miles, you're so funny having this around. May I? Oh, my God. What the hell? Too what? Where is Dave Batista? They definitely like each other. You think they saw the first influencer to have a million followers on Twitch? Yes, I did. Dude. Mm -hmm. Deal with it. Hello. Duke, your girlfriend is on top of Miles right now. <laughs> That's what I did with Alpha. Oh. That's what we did with Alpha. Disrupt. I fired Andy. And I fired the person who helped me build it. If you want to shake things up, you start with something small. Because as it turns out, nobody wants you to break the system itself. I didn't just get all like... Why do you just get all like deep all of a sudden? I'm not sure. I don't think anyone's paying attention to him. Is what unites. I'm definitely not. All of us. I am, but I just don't know what he's saying. We all got to that line, and crossed it. I feel like what he said was just kind of nonsense. Wow. <laughs> mm. That was some real red pill stuff, Mom. Yeah. Can you spot the other thing? The real thing this group has in common. Everybody knows who Lionel works for. That's no secret. He pays for all, all of them, or what? Do he pay for all of their friendships? Touch Birdie with a ten-foot pole because she went on Oprah and compared herself to Harriet Tubman. And <laughs> <spirit>. <laughs> wow.
when Duke got banned from Twitch for hawking rhino horn boner pills to teenage boys... With zero rhino on those pills. Who do you think set them up in YouTube and used their media empire to promote the stream? We need to get in contact with... I feel like this movie is trying to be so, like... We're very relevant. We're, we're talking about relevant topics. I don't know. And it's very true. It's very on point. I'm a truth teller. Some people can't handle it. It's a dangerous thing to mistake speaking without thought for speaking the truth. Mm. Man. Benoit Blanc is a master of thought. Something's off. What do you mean? She's changed. Did it not just look like Andy was like struggling to yeah. walk? Yeah. Bird showed me the statement that you wanted to make to the press about Bangladesh. And so is she just Birdie's assistant and not like actually part of the friend group? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. It is her only way out. Out of what? <clears throat> Something about Bangladesh. Bangladesh. And what Blanc hiding behind the big butt statue? Dong. What is this? Is a smokeless garden. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh man. He's messing everything up. Oh. This is what I saw on TikTok. Wow, okay. What in the world? Benoit Blanc can see. Damn, oh, dude. He just has to let that happen because Miles, like, saved him. Yeah. Whatever. Is this my Cuban breeze? The drink that got us on the no-fly list at St. Bart's. What else? Red Silica for Hashtag Peg. <laughs> wow. Temp White. Are you not Greek? <laughs> Halle Berry. <laughs> <laughs> Halle Berry. I mean, I know you have a thing for it, but... This, this place is the Tate Modern. Why is the Mona would Lisa? You hang a framed. <laughs> or. It's actually the real Mona Lisa. Come on. No way. Blame it on the Pando Blanc. The Pando. The pandemic. And so I bought myself a little short term loan. Check this out. Oh my god. <laughs> what? If it detects heat at all, it really shuts. Had a little override button installed. Oh, yeah, Where do you, you think did. it is? <laughs> oh my gosh. It really is something. It's classic. Daryl's here. Dude sees the Mona Lisa in person, the real one. He goes, classic. <laughs> Daryl's sick. He's my favorite. I want to be responsible for something that gets mentioned in the same breath as the Mona Lisa. Forever. That's a new solid hydrogen fuel. It's incredibly powerful. It's radically efficient. Zero carbon emissions. Use that for cars instead of gas? I call it Clear with a K. And at this event, we are going to announce Clear America, our affordable home power solution. Clear? Oh, she looks very nervous about this. I told you I need two years minimum to test this stuff to see if it's safe or even viable. Claire and I are not going to be responsible for putting something out in the world before it is tested and... Oh, yeah. No. Oh, it's you. It's fueling this entire place. Wow. The whole glass onion is powered by Clear. Oh, my God, Miles. Wow. They don't even know if it's safe. I'm out. I'm done. This is reckless. And you're going to get somebody killed. But now the real fun starts. Eric Cameron's sitting next door. Yeah. I saw a thing on Twitter that the mural in front of them is uh, Kanye. But if anyone can name the killer, tell me how they achieved the murder, and most importantly, what was the motive, that person wins our game. Uh, wait, what are we with? <laughs> no, no, nothing. I just... I, I just thought maybe there was a prize or something. I, I, an iPad or like. <laughs> What are we playing What's for? What's the incentive? Fine. Yeah, no, no, the winner gets an iPad. No, uh, once you're dead, will we still be able to talk to you? <laughs> dude. Yeah, I'm not playing dead the whole weekend, dude. I, we hang, but I... 
Dude got some murder on his mind right now. I don't now. actually need an iPad. <laughs> just saying. No. No, it's designed to be hard. This, this will take the whole weekend. Mm. Oh, have we started already? Is it? Well, the murder hasn't happened. Oh, okay. But, yeah, why not? As Watson said to Holmes. It was Birdie. <laughs> <laughs> what? Revenge for you stealing her signature Ren Diamond. No way. What? Look at the seat arrangement. Oh my god. No way he already figured it out. Just perfectly with that thing, which is loaded with a dummy bolt. Aimed directly at Mr. Braun. Now, That's I believe. Yeah. Oh my god. Of course, there are other superfluous and rather clumsy clues. The hedgerow in the South Garden, that spells the letter B. Birdie's room is a sick old chocolate. just like ruin the weekend. Just ruin the weekend, yeah, the whole mystery. He said, this will take the whole weekend to solve. There it is. Oh my god. A dramatic, passionate, and colorful crime oh, for a man Everything he planned. Unfortunately, Where's my iPad? This crime clashed. With the presence <laughs> of Benoit Blanc. Uh. <laughs> oh, that's funny. He ruined everything. And now he's actually gonna get murdered. My God, that just felt so good, so <laughs> so solid, so so satisfying. You know, you know, like one. He's been waiting for this for a while. What am I supposed to do now? Play Yahtzee all weekend? The truth is, I, I, I ruined your game on purpose, and for a very good reason. Uh-oh. You're manipulating your friends. I like the glass onion as a metaphor, an object that seems densely layered, but in reality, the center is in place. True. You've taken seven people, each of whom has a real-life reason to wish you harm, gathered them together on a remote island, and place the idea of your murder in their heads. It's like putting a loaded gun on the table and turning off the lights. He's saying he wants to get killed? Yeah, I think so. Oh, this is the famous napkin. I know this story. What are the people up to? Just chilling, there's nothing to do. Yeah, the, the murder mystery is just gone. <laughs> You know, you could just power down. <laughs> yeah, it's my Google Alerts. Down for all you guys, whiskey, sports, I like general interest. You have a Google Alert for the word movie? I like movies. <laughs> An alert for every time it says a movie. And we all stuck with Miles. What do you want? Do you want to know why we did it? Hmm? Really? Why? Money, money, money. My life was taken away from me. By someone, by everyone in this room. My life. You want revenge? You want to slit Miles' throat? Oh. Down? What, what was that look she, uh, she gave? Birdie J. Yeah, that was I weird. want the truth. I want the truth. I want the truth too. What really went down? I can give you that. The truth is, is that we are all holding on to that golden tooth. I'm tired of pretending like you're the victim in this game. You just couldn't hack it. Mmm, he's saying she Jeez, wasn't smart man. enough. That's harsh as hell. There she is, there's Andy, I know. <laughs> okay. He needs to turn those alerts off, dude. Yeah. For real. Duke smiling. There it is, there's my guy. What's going on? You look like you got good I news. I feel like something's gonna happen. I was wondering why my goobs are blowing up. The views on my channel are off the charts. You gotta see this. The views are crazy for Duke. You look at those numbers. It's fire. It changes things, right? Now. It sure does. Yeah, we can talk alpha news. You bet your ass. Come here. <laughs> Congratulations. Yeah. What's alpha news? I have no clue. In the end, you just gotta keep the faith. Maybe it's like. Guys, have I ever let you down? Why? Everything's like building up. I don't know. Yeah, it's like becoming chaotic a yeah. little bit. Fake it till you make it and have fun while we're doing it. Yeah, it's happening. <laughs> like that shit mm -hmm. is fucking Don't giving me anxiety, bro. He's just gonna fall over and die or something. Wow, look at that dress fit. Birdie, that's amazing. Just, just, 
Watch this dress. Watch you spin that dress again. Everybody, Milo says, look at me. What's gonna happen? I feel like the, the thing closing is like a countdown. Turn up the music, we're going in the pool tonight! We're all starting in the pool tonight, that's what I want. Nice. Oh no. Duke. <laughs> Duke's the death? That is a wrench. I did notice that they swapped drinks right yeah. when he sat down. No. Oh no. Oh wow. I didn't expect that. That's poison, baby. That's poison if I've ever seen it. For sure. He is dead. Okay, I think that it, this poison was given to him when he bumped in with Claire. Remember they had like a weird little bumping? No, but the drink was meant for. Cody is, is dead. <gasps> Duke. Duke. No, or, or, oh, because um, they swapped at the last second. Yeah. So Duke drank his drink. Yeah, it was definitely meant for Miles. Tell him we need medical personnel and please. Okay, yeah. Listen, I, I must insist that nobody touch the body. Police? Uh oh. Are, are you treating this as a crime scene then? I mean, he just fell over and died, bro. What do you mean? My guess is something was put in his drink. Intentionally. Hmm. I did see them switch it. I'll stay up all night, but the body makes us not tampered with it anyway. That's his cup. Yeah, he drank out of Miles' cup. That is... That's your glass, Miles. He picked up mine. Yep. Oh, how do you not? So then he couldn't have been in on it. I don't know. No, we could. Killed me. I'll pay you one billion dollars to tell me which one of them tried to kill me. Miles. I'm just gonna silence. <laughs> We're staying right here in this room. I'm keeping you all in plain sight until that boat arrives. He has changed his tune. He's very scared now. Where's whiskey? Where's Andy? Oh. Where's Duke's phone? Forget about his phone, look. The gun is gone. So Andy or whiskey has it? My murder game. We were gonna be having drinks and I thought it'd be fun to say something dramatic just at 10 o'clock and then we were gonna have 20 minutes where... Huh? Blanc, you tell me. You have to help me, help what? me, help me! Oh no. The power goes out. <sighs> what do you say? It's like putting a loaded gun in a dark room. That's what we got now. Putting a loaded gun on the table. In a dark room. In a dark room. We got a loaded gun in a dark house now. Oh, that's crazy with that, that light just going. It was Andy! It was Andy! She killed Duke and she tore her room apart! I saw her! What? Today. Wait, 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 wait. He's leaving. Benoit Blanc's gonna get to the bottom of this. Yeah, he is. Who, who do we think? I don't think he Claire. was Andy. Fuck, dude, I honestly have no idea. Oh, Andy. Andy's hiding. Andy. He looks scared, huh? What was Whiskey talking about? I wouldn't be totally surprised if it was Miles setting this whole thing up. Yeah. But then you can't explain why Duke grabbed his drink. Mm hmm. He put it down at the right spot. Inting. Did you take Duke's gun? Why would I take Duke's gun? And why are the lights Duke is out? Dead. What? Uh... Oh god, the gun. The gun. The person's right there. Okay, they want to shoot Andy. No, they just fucking pulled the the thing back. We only need one last piece of information, but only you can. Yep. Oh my god. And he just got shot. No way. I think Andy just got killed. What? There's no way. Hey guys, I want to bring up one point. Watch, Duke's gonna come back. 
one thing we shall not forget, guys. Daryl is here. If Daryl's relevant at all, I'm gonna be pissed. I'll be loved. The ones on the side where the shooting was is Whiskey and Claire. Yeah. Didn't think Andy was gonna die. She killed two. Why would she? No. It makes no sense. It all makes perfect sense. Here we go. Only one person can tell us who killed Cassandra Brand. Who's that? Andy. No, the guy that walks around. <laughs> oh, this is when they dropped off the box. Who dropped it off? It was a dude, I think. Yeah. Oh my God, it's Hugh Grant. Uh, Hugh Grant. This, is this Benoit Blanc's residence? Um, what is this regarding? Well, his office was closed and I read. Who's that? That's awesome. I saw on Twitter that Q oh, Grant. Oh, it's her. Andy. With her broken box. My name is Helen Brand, and I came all the way here from Alabama. Probably Andy's sister. Is that not Andy just Andy? Really matter. No, that's it. Andy's sister. You said Helena Brand? Helen Brand? Yeah, it's Andy's name is Cassandra Brand. It's probably your <gasps> sister. In her car. Oh my god. So she. Had... What? The real Andy committed suicide. What? That is a. F you know, she kept a journal every day of her life since she was six years old. So she. She's dressed. She's, she's been pretending to be Andy for sure. And she just got fucking shot. Then Ben Wall should know that. I think he's telling them that now. I think him and Helen, like, plotted together going into this. They knew that something more was going on for sure. Because he said that, like, this game started before they got there. What can I do for you? I think she's the one that hired Andy him to do this. Didn't commit suicide. She didn't leave any note. Oh, he knew that the box was fake. He was like, oh, I've been fooled. Oh, no. Yeah. <laughs> he knew the whole time. He's an actor. It's right here. And I'm going to use it to burn his whole empire down. I'm gonna this is crazy. Right. You know where to find me. Hey. She oh, was threatening she, him? She was... Blackmailing so them for sure. Somebody definitely killed. You think the person who was there killed her? She sends that email. Nobody writes back anything. And then the next day, she's dead in the garage with mm. sleeping pills in her system. And guess what wasn't there? Her journal? It's a red envelope. Oh. Uh. Compelling. That's why he definitely took it, because he knew. This case. Yeah. It's probably something he wanted. She's given me, I don't know. She's given me like main character vibes right now. But now she's, she's dead. Died. <laughs> yeah, she's died. I've not seen your sister's death in the news. Did did you release a statement? No. Shit. Was I supposed to? No, oh, don't do that, cause then you can't then, go there. Yeah. I could keep it from leaking to the press for another week, maybe. It's... Oh no, that's outrageous. I don't know if this is relevant at all, but Duke said he had their names as Google Alerts. So if she died, he would have gotten an alert. Yeah. Did you come with me? As your sister. That island. As your sister. Yep. As Cassandra Brand. What? <laughs> I'm hiring you to go. I, I'm not. Are you insane? Oh, he's going to feel so guilty yeah. because he's the one that got her to go and now she's dead. That's probably why Miles was so shocked to see her, like when she walked onto the beach. Maybe she had just threatened him. Cause, Maybe because she he, thought he, he thought was, he thought she was dead. Why? Why would he think? Cause oh, cause, he killed cause, her because they visited. Yeah, huh? Like Andy, you're here. Yeah, that's very smart. Mr. Blanc, is is this safe? No, it's not. You're gonna die. From the moment you arrive on that island, the killer will know who you yep. are and what you are doing. One of those shitheads killed. So someone tried killing Miles? What? Yeah. With the poison? But maybe I, it's, I'm still not ruling Miles out. I feel like he could have set the, the cup thing up. I'll get there early. Really lay on some southern hokum. Get them all off guard. On the boat. Yeah, be cold. Yeah, dude, they set this whole thing up in the beginning. Well, we can't rule it out, but Miles Brown is not an idiot. To risk committing murder after a very public court case. They were all friends with Andy. Okay, so they knew 
They all knew each other through Andy originally. Yep. This is Miles. Hey, guys. Nice to meet you, Miles. Hey, bro. Hey, looks older yeah. back First, here. Nobody liked him. <laughs> he still like. You know, I wanna, I wanna be responsible for something that gets talked about in the same breath as the Mona Lisa. Forever. Still says that. What is that even? <laughs> yeah, like. And then the big thing. Oh, happened. she did the. It, Andy what wrote it on the, on the piece of napkin. Look. Not him. She wrote the equation. Andy's the real genius behind it all. Andy, Andy, come on. This is it. No, no, no. This is not a startup. This could blow up the world. Wait, what do you mean you can't let me? I'll walk. Go for it. She was cut out the company completely. So she yeah. should go with that. Her whole case was based on intellectual ownership. Her idea on the napkin. Which she didn't keep. Miles was... Very excited. He had an idea. Wow, he just completely lied about that. And he has the napkin in his... Yep, it's just not his handwriting. A bald face fabrication. A damn lie. And it worked. Wow. Damn, bro. Oh. She has it. He doesn't even have the real one. He's a fake one hanging up. Is that what she just emailed? Okay. Oh, no, he has it. That was what was in the envelope. Oh. How did he get that? They couldn't find the envelope. It had to be him. He had to be involved in it. Yeah, I think so. And bro's gonna pull me aside to explain my presence. That is your chance to snoop. Snoop. What is she gonna find? Snooping. Snooping. Remember Whiskey said that she destroyed her room. Yeah. This feels like it all leads to Miles. That's what they want you to think, though. That's a beautiful necklace. You a Taurus? Yeah, um, Miles got it. Me from too, Whiskey. He, We're compatible. Uh, stuff. Yeah, but not Madeline. I think it's really shitty what they all did to you. And how they all treated you. I read your court transcripts and you got shanked. Damn, Whiskey's kind of cool. I'm building my brand. And he's putting me on his channel yeah. more often. Using him for clout. Mm -hmm. I feel like she's a lot smarter than she puts on to be. Yeah, I feel like she puts on an act around everybody. Mm -hmm. You signed off on the power plant. Yep. When this thing breaks, poof. My whole base is gone. Let's just pray that Andy was wrong about this clear stuff. Now she was right. I know. I sold my soul for this. Oh my god. It could literally turn people's homes that is into the hit. Fucking dangerous, bro. Having hydrogen gas in people's homes. I was the one on magazines. He was nobody. Recording them. Oh, yeah. But Andy! Hi! Now if she leaves, they're going to talk about her. Interesting stuff about whiskey and motives for both Lionel and Claire. Well done. Those were motives? Mm-hmm. Because I was kind of confused. <laughs> I love her switching up accents. Mm -hmm. It's funny. She's slamming the kombucha. I thought you said you didn't drink. Oh, this is a drink. This is some. Yeah, alcohol. It's spiked. That's hard kombucha. That's Jared Leto. Who's <laughs> <laughs> that? How many of these things you have? I don't know, but I feel fine. Okay? We need to focus. We need to focus. Oh, is that why she was stumbling that one time? Probably. Yeah. yeah. So now you want to talk about the emails. You didn't even write back. I'm a politician. I never email anything that I wouldn't want to see on the phone. Yeah, that's definitely a good reason. That's why I called. <laughs> we all did. Right after we got it, over and over. What? I went to your house. Lionel and I got there at the same time. Duke was already... Huh. This is weird. I was pounding so hard I almost broke it down. Where did Andy go? We knocked and waited and called for you, and after an hour we left. Birdie. Oh, oh, it's because she's dead. Because she's dead. They don't understand that she's what dead. What time did you get there? I don't know. It was dark. So she died like right after she, she yeah, sent Yeah, she it? sent the letter and was dead the next day. Remember she said that? If I would have answered the door that night, would you have said, I'm sorry. I back you with Miles. Or were you just showing up so you could stop me from using that envelope? <laughs> just to stop you. Not trying to help you. That's everything she said, I think. 
I think maybe you should take up drinking. You're just killing it. <laughs> <laughs> but Duke He's the drunk detective. Birdie came late. Yeah, but they could have gone there early, killed your sister, circled away, and then waited for the Serena. other to Serena. Serena. Oh, oh, she's looking. Like, hey. For mm. Duke or Birdie. Do so, either of you two what? want to do a... <laughs> wow, oh, she's actually here. Um, that is actually crazy. No, no, no not right now. <laughs> oh, the fax machine. Maybe later. All right, it's your money. All right. Holy shit! From that afternoon, just minutes after Andy sent the email, Lionel faxed it to me. Hmm. Look, babe, we really need this. So do this for me one last time, okay? Whiskey? No, there's no way. Hello. Oh. No, was he telling Whiskey to go sleep with Miles? Yeah. Maybe. Yeah. What? Yeah. He told her to do this. They're trying to get... Trying to use Miles. It's all he wants. The YouTube channel's dying. He needs the exposure. Just put him on alpha males, baby. Just a Wow. Wow. What is this? An email from the Sweetie Pants contractor two years ago. Oh no, what is this bad email? Is it the proposed Bangladesh oh, yeah. is notoriously one sweatshops, of the sweatshops, yep. We were advice. told about this. They knew about this. Perfect, thanks. Ugh. With your memoji dabbing. <laughs> wow, that couldn't be any worse. Please tell me you did not think sweatshops. Where they make sweats. Or where they make oh. Sweatpants. That is exactly what she thought. Whoever killed your sister took that envelope to protect Miles. And they wouldn't just what if they're just it. all in on it? I want him to see what they've done. No. Then. Yeah, they that wouldn't make sense. I think it's Daryl. It's got to be one person. Daryl. Yeah, it could be. I'm gonna walk out of here if it's or Daryl. Rick Grimes. We have to find that envelope. You're the loser. That's the truth. Oh, that's why she destroyed the room. She's looking for the envelope. Mm-hmm. This is where Whiskey finds her because that spear gun's there. Oh no, it broke. The news broke about her sister. Uh oh. Those are all messages giving like his condolences. Oh. Maybe Duke saw and had a heart attack? No. <laughs> oh, the spear gun just fell out. Yeah. But Duke would have seen it. He deserved what he got. And you are better off without him. No, she thinks she killed her. Oh, him. yeah. What the fuck? Ah! No, kill me! What? Oh, my what? God! I'm not trying to kill you, you crazy bitch! <laughs> <laughs> oh, my oh. gosh, dude. What? She's you shot? Piece of information. Oh no. You can oh, that's crazy, bro. That's Who nuts. is it? Right through the glass. <gasps> Bulletproof vest. <sighs> Wait, what? A bitch. And he's like, get back down, get back down. Oh, her, her journal. journal. Oh, that's awesome. Get what? back down, get back down. Yeah, pretend to be dead, pretend to be dead. Blood. Jamie Renner's hot sauce. You have to find that envelope. I will. That's it. Oh, no, give me oh, that. yes, I'm so happy she's yeah. dead. Let's go. Dude, they are sick together. Yeah, I love this duo. Him and Anna Diarmas were really cool together in the first movie, but I, this duo here is yeah. really, really, yeah. I'm really digging it. It's on her face. Hot sauce. Hot sauce. Probably burns. I don't want to go in your mouth. Oh, it's going to drip down to her oh. eye. Oh. And her nose. No. Oh, that is crazy, bro. <laughs> Shit balls. She just left. I can peel back. All right, we're caught up. What if he says it again? And we go back and dive. And in we it. do see it all again. Quite the movie. I keep returning, in my mind, to the glass onion. Something that seems densely layered, mysterious, and inscrutable. But in fact, the center is in plain sight. What, Miles? Is that the answer? I expected intelligence. I expected a puzzle. 
again. It hides not behind complexity, but behind mind numbing obvious clarity. What? Oh, I see it all. right there. Oh, yeah. And I was staring right at it. It's right behind me. Oh, shit. Not the worst hiding spot. Yeah, but still, who gave it to him? Exactly, yeah. We don't know if he didn't take it himself. At the last moment, I realized what it teased my brain through this. Wow, did she get lucky with that shot, huh? Yeah. Hit the journal. Abbreviate. Not a word. Yeah, I was going to say, I've never heard that. Can we just take a second and fully abbreviate this moment? <laughs> it's not a real word. It kind of sounds like one, but it's just entirely made up. Now, reclamation. Now, nah, well, there. I think he's trying to buy time for her right now. Yeah. This place, it's the full reclamation of everything I've achieved up to now. This entire day. The pre-definite detective. A veritable minefield of malapropisms. The infraction point. And Bask in the sun, swim in the Ionian Sea. That is <laughs> the Aegean Sea. <laughs> it is. His dock doesn't go. His wonder fuel. He's a complete... Cham, bro. None of the shit's real. I assumed Miles Braun was a complicated genius. Miles Braun is an idiot. Yeah, <laughs> I've come to realize that. He is kind of a total idiot. Duke took my glass. That's what you told us he did. Mmm. What did we all actually see? Wow. Look at that dress spin. Bertie, that's amazing. Just just That is what happened, huh? Yeah. The night Andy sent you all the emails, when Duke got to Andy's house early on his motorcycle, he saw Miles leaving. Mm. Was almost struck by him. In fact, uh -oh. he told all of us. Right out in the open, he told us. You remember that night you almost pancaked me with it on the road outside of Andy's? Anderson Cooper's birthday. Oh, oh, oh shit. Miles had been living in Greece the past six months. Nope. Whiskey. Mm -hmm. I saw you on your birthday in New York. Gave you that necklace for your birthday. You're a Taurus. I am. I <laughs> am. Yeah. Hello. I'm back. <gasps> Holy shit. Oh, that look. All right. I'm Helen, not Andy. Hello. Who did the envelope threaten? Miles Braun. She didn't see the real threat. The obvious. He's so good. Until it was too Blog. Late. He do He fucking drugged her and then put her in that car, bro. That is crazy. But he didn't know Andy was dead. No, no, he didn't know that until this evening, right here, when he got a yep. Google alert he on his the phone, alert. which is now fallen strangely. Yeah, where does phone go? He showed to you. Right out in the open, Duke showed him. It changes things, right? It sure does. And oh. So what does Miles do? Does well, how is he smart? Or is that some rich person thing? No, 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 no. It's just, it's so much stupider. <laughs> what are the ingredients to your Cuban breeze? Oh, God. What's he allergic to? Pineapple juice. You keep pineapples away from me. No pineapple in there, right? Duke, don't dance with pineapple. <laughs> An allergy. He just put pineapple juice in his whiskey. It, it's so dumb. <laughs> <laughs> it's really stupid. No. She survived by her sister, Helen. Hello, I'm Helen. Helen. You told me about Helen. That's me. I am Helen. <laughs> oh, wait. Oh, wow, Birdie, you are slow. Yeah. You have a loaded gun conveniently within reach. And the lights have even been turned off. It's like putting a loaded gun on the table and turning off. Did he just listen to what he said? <laughs> you dim-witted He just did exactly what he told him to do. You're one murder with any panache at all. And you stole the whole idea from me. That's ridiculous. It was just Miles the whole time. How could you ever prove that that's the original? She might have copied mine. No. 
Hers has one thing that George just doesn't. Hmm. It's just a napkin. Okay, but second. Oh. oh, he just burned it, bro. Did you see this proof? This smoking napkin blanc? No. Did anybody? Guy's such a fucking snake, dude. How are we gonna get him without the napkin? They can't stand up to him. And there's nothing but totally circumspective evidence. So if this was circumspective. <laughs> He's right. No hard hitting evidence. Y your sister was a complicated woman, but she meant the world to me. And I'm so sorry for your loss. Shut the fuck up, dude. Such a sleazeball. You literally killed her. Raise your hand and say I saw him take Duke's gun. Damn. I saw him that night at These people all suck, dude. Yeah, they're terrible. I'm sorry, Helen. I gave you the truth. This is when my Daryl's gonna be like, oh, I saw it. <laughs> Offer you some courage and a reminder of why your sister walked away in the first place. What is this? What is he? What did he just give her? Well, what did he? I think he just handed her something. What is in her hand? Oh, the rock. Oh yeah, yeah, I yeah, yeah, yeah. Blow this bitch up. Is it actually gonna blow the house up? <laughs> I love this build up, and then she's gonna be like, mm. oh, slam it into the ground. This is satisfying. Yeah, I'd love to do this. Yeah. <laughs> hell yeah! <laughs> Why the hell not? Yeah, go Helen! Right, go Helen! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Birdie's letting it out, bro. Oh yeah. You go. Yeah, I think we should. Hey, Miles! <laughs> Coming in real hot. Helen, easy. There's a whole ass mace. Oh my God. I think that belonged to Liberace. Okay, I... Mona Lisa. Mona Lisa. Oh. What? What? What is it? What do you want? Burn it. We're not. Oh God. Whoa. I want to see the Mona Lisa burn. Thought I'd never say that. She's like, build that fire. Let's go. Let's get it big. What is she doing? Burn the bitch down. Burn the whole place down. Oh, dude, I, thought, I, just, I thought it was him. I just thought he fell into the fire. Yeah, that yeah. was a blanket. Helen, walk away. Yeah. With a reminder of why my sister walked away in the first place. The hydrogen shit. Yep. That's why she walked away. What is she gonna do with a throw in the fire? Yeah, I think so. Uh oh. It's running on everything. Oh shit! Hindenburg. Oh. Oh my god, it's all gonna blow up. Oh my god. Are they all gonna die? Everything is blowing up. Oh god. <laughs> He's just out here waiting with Daryl. <laughs> yeah. He's chilling with Daryl. Disruption. <laughs> the disruptors. Fuck it, A. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, oh baby, baby blue. blue fuck baby blue super nice car but fuck fuck miles yep what are you gonna say oh my house blew up because i was doing this illegal testing for this method that's gonna blow up homes all across america oh yeah i don't think I it's, it's gonna be protected yeah, yeah it's protected she's going after it next though oh <laughs> Fucking cross. Mona 
Lisa, Mona, Mona Lisa. How do you Where explain this to the French government? Oh my god, look at that. What is she gonna do? Oh no. That's a safe proof thing, right? Yep. You're gonna break it? I think that's all she gotta do is just fucking. Is just. He missed. Oh, the tackle. turn it off, turn it off. Yep, then let the fire in. That dumbass told him. Yep. Wow. That's See kinda, ya! That's kind of fucked up, though. Wow. One of a kind piece of art. That was like all of his money. Did he have like a mortgage or something for it? I don't know, everything. They all just lived the explosion. You think you popped me like a gangster? No! You baby! Ah, you child! What? You feel better now? What is wrong? This guy's a, insane. Your feel of the future just barbecued. The world's most famous painting, you dumbass. <laughs> Congratulations on the public launch of Clear and the end of Miles. Wow. Prime. All right. They don't have to defend him anymore. No. And you did get your wish to forever be remembered. In, in the same, same breath, breath as the Mona Lisa. Oh, that's so funny. You destroyed it. No. No. Gang, we all saw Helen the is thing. an absolute badass. She's sick. He was definitely the, my favorite character. I saw the napkin he burned. <laughs> God, now that you mention it, I clearly saw him grab Duke's gun. Mm, he's, I mean, I like that they're switching up, but these people are just fucking snakes. Yeah. Dude. Way too late. They just say whatever helps them the most. Nice job, Helen. He gave her the... Freaking, the, what was it? The hydrogen? Clear. Yeah. And a glass of whiskey because she knows he could, she gets it done better when she's drunk. All right. Glass onion. Um, What'd you guys think? Do you like it better than Knives Out? What I think we? so. I'm, I did not like it more than Knives Out. I really did enjoy it though. Um, It felt very different to me than Knives Out did. Uh, Not, not in a bad way at all, but it, it just felt very different it felt i don't know it felt more like less mystery at points and more actiony and more like suspense whereas like i feel felt like knives out was more of a thought out fully complete mystery with a bad guy at the end um where i and i feel like benoit blanc put it best it was all stupid like everything that this guy put together was dumb because he was a dumb guy like it was a very interesting mystery, but um, at the end of the day, like the thing that Edward Norton set up and everything was just kind of stupid. It was all kind of dumb. He poisoned it with pineapple juice, bro. Like what? I don't know. Yeah, that's kind of smart though. Cause then it... <laughs> it was stupidly smart, but no, it was it was just stupid. I think I liked it more than that, or like the first one. I just I don't know. I like the I wouldn't say I like the cast more, but. I was actually gonna say I liked the cast more in the first one for sure. <laughs> you guys are <laughs> yeah. completely different. No, sides I there. totally understand why like why people might like this one more, but uh I don't know. I will say I I liked Helen way more as a uh companion than I did Anna Diarmas, and I did not think that uh that was gonna happen because I really, really liked her character in the first movie, but Helen kind of blew me away. She was a badass in this movie. Especially like for the first like half, you don't even know that it's Helen. You think it's Andy. I feel like this one was a lot more uh, comedic though, too. Yeah, for sure it was. I think I liked. I got a lot of laughs out of this one, and you know, like you said, I liked Helen much more than Anna de Armas. And it just felt. I don't know. I liked the setting more. I liked the island. I just thought it was um, like such a cooler atmosphere than. Like that cooped up house it was sort of in the middle of the woods that's what i was gonna say i think i like how this one looks better but I like the story of knives out better this one was way more colorful and like it was like you said at the beginning the vacation setting like. yeah and the ending was so badass 
I mean, the freaking Mona Lisa was in this one. That's awesome. Yeah, this one felt like really over the top in some areas. Like they just went all out for everything. Like, I mean, the set was just crazy. Like, look where they are. This whole place is just fucking nuts, dude. That glass onion looks crazy. And I saw on Twitter that that's like a real place. Like you can, I think, go there for a very large amount of money. That CGI must have been crazy on that place. Like, <laughs> when they shit. blew it up. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, there was a lot of twists in this movie that I really did like. I don't think any of us... That's the thing. It's like, I don't think any of us saw it coming, really, because it was just too obvious of the answer. Yeah. It's just like, well, it can't be Miles, right? Yeah, we were like, he has the napkin, but it can't be him, right? Like, Who gave it to easy. him? Yeah, who gave it to him? I don't know. I, I was very caught off guard with Duke's death. I didn't think that he was going to die. I, I definitely was fully expecting miles to get killed somehow and the mystery was still going to be about his murder but completely went in a different direction uh i really i did enjoy a lot the whole like flashback sequence where we got to see the like entire build up to the moment where andy gets shot um i thought that was really cool a, a cool way of like storytelling I like that maybe a little bit too much at some points <laughs> but like half the movie was like this is actually what happened during this. Mm -hmm. Like, I know that's what makes a like movie really good though. But yeah, but like I think we said it. These, these like quote unquote friends of his are just like they really weren't that great. Like the whole yeah. through and through. I mean, if you need that much to wake you up and like stand up, I guess it is their livelihoods. Mm -hmm. And if they shot him, he would ruin their lives pretty much if they stood up to him kind of has so much control but like i don't know just if uh andy didn't talk to him that one day at the bar like he was life, a nobody life would have been a lot different yeah a lot better andy literally created all of these relationships and look what it got her they stabbed her in the back every single one of them i thought daniel craig was awesome again he always plays such a good part and i think i liked him more in this movie he was just so i just i feel like the comedy in this movie i feel like benoit blanc was definitely very different in this movie he he like was the same like funny benoit blanc or like smart benoit blanc but uh i, I feel like it kind of goes on to being funnier they made him more comical in this movie for sure um which definitely not a bad thing i loved it i, I loved the comedy aspect of benoit blanc and all the silly outfits he was wearing and everything it was it was super cool i i did see that like ryan johnson confirmed he's already writing the third movie um so i'm, I'm pumped i can't wait i love these. these these are some of my favorite like mystery movies yeah i think in one of our q a's like someone asked us to, to like what's like if we if we had to make a movie or like cast and mm -hmm. plot and i think like no, I did. I think maybe you did as well. Rob did like a knives out kind of like cast. Like mm -hmm. it's just a really cool concept. Just putting so many just huge actors together, and then it's like a murder mystery. So it's yeah. like, what's gonna happen? Who did it? Yeah, it's just really fun to watch, especially when when you know and are attached to some of these actors like we are with this movie. Got a little Hugh Grant cameo there. Or something yeah, like. dude, that was one thing I saw on social media before I watched the movie. Um, that was like love the fact that. Hugh Grant is like Benoit Blanc's partner like that's yeah. so cool and uh, another thing I saw on social media that I just thought was like a funny thing is people were like we need a Knives Out Muppets version where it's just Benoit Blanc with all of the Muppets solving like a mystery like this I think I, I, that I, would be awesome dude I think I saw the director said like oh that'll it. never happen yeah but it's oh, just, I thought they I saw they said it would be a good idea yeah it, it would be a good idea but I don't think it would ever happen um that would be so good though. Can you imagine? I'd like watch it. Benoit Blanc and then Kermit the Frog right next to like <laughs> Hey Benoit, what's going on? What? Let's figure out this case. Like that would be so that was funny. Good, bro. Actually. <laughs> that, where did that come from? <laughs> I I liked uh one of the funnier moments for me was whenever Daniel Craig was just like naming all of these words that Edward Norton's character had said throughout the movie so far. And it was just like, dude, you're you're not as smart as you think you are, bro. These are all made up words that just sound like real words. Like the, f the fact that I, I just loved him, his character getting exposed for like being a fraud because he, he really is a fraud. Like pretty much his entire career is built around taking advantage of people and manipulating them. So yeah, glad that guy got what he deserved. Even if we weren't able to like prove that he had wronged Andy legally or whatever, 
Helen got the revenge the best way possible, I think. That was my favorite part of the movie when they showed Helen not being dead. I'm like, all right, this is Yeah, that was cool. a twist too. Yeah, that was good. That was really good. That 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 was another thing that I was completely caught off guard was when Helen got shot or Andy got shot. Uh didn't expect that whatsoever. That was crazy. And they do like a twenty minute like recap of like what led up to that and then you you're like we're feeling bad for Helen for dying because she was skeptical about coming. Mm -hmm. It's like, damn. Honestly, I was like, how the hell is Benoit Blanc gonna keep working? Like, I feel like that would be, like, that'd be crazy on your conscience. Like, yeah, if he, that's what I mean. I think I said it at one point. He's gonna be so guilty for, for made, like pretty much making her come here. I think that is really cool though that it's her journal that she wrote in every day since she was like six, that stopped the bullet, but pretty small journal i don't know how you had enough pages for every day since you were six but um saved your sister from a bullet so w there if you had to pick one character like in this cast obviously not benoit blanc but to go on a date with whiskey for sure i'm going with whiskey um yeah i think me and her would get along we, we're both tauruses and i just think we'd be compatible what about you guys i would pick whiskey i think she's really well, i already not. picked her so so my question was going to be like who your favorite character was in the show or in the movie besides oh, Benoit Blanc. it was helen for sure helen yeah helen was great helen was great for sure especially when we started seeing like the backstory of her like getting mm -hmm. drunk and stuff i thought she was so cool yeah i would i would probably say helen or benoit blanc pretty pretty basic yeah that's how it is sometimes though it's like of course you're gonna like them they're Mm -hmm. I, you can't dislike that. I mean, all the other characters were literally just assholes. Yeah, yeah that I was think, the whole I think, point of their character. I think, like, out of the assholes, though, my favorite was definitely Dave Batista. Yeah, he, he was, was funny sick. as hell. He was just talking about his Twitch and his YouTube channel. Like, yeah, I didn't know how I felt about some of those parts. Like, how it, like, he was. I, I, I said it at the beginning. Yeah. I, like, I, that was one thing that I, I thought was a little bit cringy about this movie that it felt like it was trying to be so, like, this movie was takes place now. It could take place today. Like we were talking about TikTok and Snapchat and like I I don't know. Benoit felt, Blanc's playing Among Us. Yeah, it felt <laughs> a little forced at times and kind of took me out. Like the the Among Us thing was kind of funny though because he's like, I just yeah. I'm craving this great mystery. I want to solve something and he's literally playing Among Us with Kareem Abdul Jabbar in his bathtub. But that was um, awesome. But yeah, some of those lines definitely were just like, mm, we're we're trying to really emphasize that this movie takes place in a certain time. Obviously, a lot of these people's lives kind of depended on Miles. So what do you think these guys are going to be good now that they don't have him as like that crutch? I don't know. I think Claire's going to be fucked because she back, he was, she was backed by his, his money. And if he has a downfall on this, they're going to be like, oh, he was, she was backed by a fucking lunatic fraud. Yeah, I think low-key they're all also kind of fun yeah Dude, that's the kind of yeah. impression i got like birdie has that shit that's about to leak claire is just a shitty politician duke who, is dead who's entire yeah duke is dead coming back from that uh lionel literally already gave the the okay for testing on this shit so that's already a bad look for he'll probably fucking lose all of his like accolades and job or whatever because he approved this testing of clear and the, yeah that's that's about it i think egg egg she egg was I, the I, don't, assistant. I don't know why she was in the movie if we're being honest yeah she was pretty pointless she was actually kind of a pointless character she was funny at times but uh yeah i don't really know why she had to be there honestly it was cool all right guys but that's pretty much it for our reaction to glass onion if you guys did enjoy though make sure to drop a like comment and subscribe check out all the links in our description the first one's gonna be the patreon we have the full watch along for this movie so if you guys want to watch along with us the whole time sync your version up with ours and check it out make sure to do that as well as early access to future special movies that we do so make sure to check that out second link is our discord come join that talk to us about glass onion we got a movie talk chat in there where we always are talking about movies with our communities so stop by and lastly, follow our social medias. We have our Instagrams and our Twitters down there. And at the very bottom is going to be the address to our P.O. Box. Send us something to be open up on our series mail time on the channel, like everything you see behind us right now. But yeah, that's pretty much it. And we will catch you guys in our next special movie. Peace out.